Antonio Green. Our host for this broadcast is Pastor James A. Dance. Our co-host, well, is none other than the Minister Kelvin Peters. Amen. We have Amen. Minister Milton Dudley on this panel with us as well. Amen. And it is Amen. our prayer that God the Father, through Jesus Christ, his Son, by the power of the Holy Spirit, will speak truth to your hearts. Pastor Dance. Good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Lord, afternoon. Good afternoon to our Lord, audience. Praise, praise, Lord. Lord. praise hey, Lord. Praise Lord. Lord. We thank God for another, <laughs> another opportunity, Lord, give us this. That's what it is. Praise what it God, is. discuss the truth of God's word because we know and we are assured of that everything is going to go down but the truth of God. Amen. That's right. Amen. That's, That's right. right. And we stand solemnly upon that word and we just pray God uh, will speak through us today as we try to address, you know, some of the issues that we did, and one particular issue we're going to address today, but there are so many issues out here. But we know that uh, we can trace them all back to one little one little word that started with S, mm. and that mm. word is sin, isn't it? That's sin. That's it. Amen. Thank right. God. But thank God for me. Bill, how you feeling today? Man, I'm blessed, man. Good, good, good. good, good. With what Tony talking about all these spirits running up and down the road, I'm, I'm blessed. <laughs> Amen. That's right. That's right. Well, <laughs> you blessed. Act God blessed the body broadcast. <laughs> thank you, Lord. Father, we thank you now. For yes, sir. Lord, we thank you for who you are and the midst of the times that we're living in. Yes. Bless you, Lord. Realizing you, Lord. that it's your providence, Father, mm -hmm. that you brought us here together. Thank you, Lord. Lord, we thank you for the listening ears out there. Mm -hmm. Lord, let's tune in to this broadcast. Yes. Lord, yes. to hear your truth as we Speak discuss God. these life-changing situations that mm -hmm. we're dealing with. Mm -hmm. Yes, Lord. Father, we realize it's not by power nor by might. Your spirit. But by your spirit, said the Lord of hosts. Mm -hmm. And as we come, Lord, we come asking for forgiveness of sin. Forgive us, Lord. Yes. Realizing yes. all have sinned and come short of that glory. Forgive us, Lord. But right now, Lord, you have your way in this place. Yes. Speak through us. We're led by your Holy Spirit. Mm. To speak the truth of your word. Yes, Lord. In Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Amen. 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 The glory be Amen. to the Lord. Amen. 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 Praise God, brother. We uh we want to, you know, we everybody know that what's going on today over there in praise God, Israel, God's uh the it, well it's not just there. It seems like it's a, a fire that starts here and, and then mm -hmm. it began to rage all over the whole world. Mm -hmm. yeah. And uh which you know, you have to ask the question. Why is there so many people that hate Israel? Mm. Why are so many nations? Huh? And even our president Biden is beginning to uh, he's he's waffling, he, he yeah. waffling pretty good right now, you know. Mm. Uh, but uh, it just seems like uh, Israel is a target for all the haters of the world, it appears. And mm. it's, it's got to be a reason for it, you know. It and, it, and, and like, uh, you know, Tony said a while ago, I think it's, it's more spiritual than it is what we can see, right? Yeah. yeah. Amen. yeah. Yes. Amen. Because we know that Israel, Israel uh, represents uh, uh, God's people. That's right. And, uh, he chose them. That's right. And 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 mm -hmm. and, and, and with no, being saved ourselves, we know that's not based upon how good we are. That's right. right. That's that's right. Nothing to do with uh, it. Nothing, it has nothing, nothing to do, do with it. it. And because uh, Israel is not uh, an angel of light either, right? That's now. right. But yet, and still, did God God chose. God chose them as He did us. You know, when he brought us out of darkness into his marvelous light, man. He chose us, and God knows I know it ain't based upon my goodness, and because I know I ain't got a lot of that at all. I'm like Brian Amos, Pastor Lee, that long. Don't even go there, huh? But we gotta, we gotta, um, uh, I don't know, Kevin, how we gonna call it. God's chosen people of destiny is, uh, is one article that I had chosen. I want to read just a little bit of that before we cut into it, just a little bit of it. Yeah, God chose Israel. And we know God gave Israel a land. That's right. Yep. He gave them That's that right. land. Gave them not based upon anything, but his own sovereign choice, right? Mm -hmm. right. Okay, he gave them that land. So that land seemed to be in uh, in dispute. Uh, I don't know whether, 
I know you stay up pretty much on uh, on YouTube, and there's a great article on YouTube right now. Mm -hmm. And I, I read it somewhere. I got books at home, you know. You know, told you I got a thousand books, but I read it. But this guy goes all the way back to Catholicism when it first started. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And how Islam and Catholicism mm -hmm. weren't like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? And as a matter of fact, they trained. It was a spin. It was a spinoff from Catholicism. Oh, that's that's the way it started. Right. And then once but, it got so big, it tried they, to cut. They cut away. The church. Church. Yeah. 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 But but yeah. but the main target was to take back Jerusalem, absent the promised land. Look at the name. Right. That was the mm -hmm. goal. That was the goal. Yeah. yeah. They will team up together. Mm -hmm. Huh? Because now, like I say, the, the Muslims got so big until they decided to pull away from them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We want it all. We want it all to ourselves. We want it all. And plus, we're going to take we gonna, we gonna push y'all out of the picture completely, which right. is what they yeah. did, you know. Right. And uh, But uh, this there's a, there's a lot of history here. and uh, But we know that it's a spiritual battle more than it is a physical battle. The, the land, the people represent God. Mm -hmm. Well, we, we have to start looking at it from that angle, too, Pastor, we have to, for, the, yeah. for the simple fact. If mm -hmm. we just ask ourselves some simple questions and, and, and mm -hmm. answer honestly, mm -hmm. the land is not valuable. It's not like it's full of jewels. Right. And, right. Well, not like know, Africa. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, right. absolutely. Right. Right. This, country, this country. This country. Right, right. You know, but, but it, so it's not the land. It's got to be something else. Well, we can still go to Scripture. Can we go back to scripture on that? Yeah, absolutely. God called those things that be not. As though they were. No, they don't have the mineral riches. They don't have the, mm -hmm. the uh, you know, all the riches of other countries. Yeah. But yet, it's still, God took nothing of uh, dry land mm -hmm. uh, and put his name on it. <laughs> uh, Pastor, that's, that's existence. You just explained the existence in itself. God took nothing. He took nothing. And then, right. it, 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 so it's, it's, it's part of that pattern, right? <laughs> it's, it's just a little spot of land. It, it ain't right. that big. That's well, right. it, well, it on map, right. but it, you know, it's bigger when you look at it from a biblical standpoint. What, what God he gave, what he God promised. gave him, what he promised. Because if you if we look at what God gave Israel, you 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 done jumped all over. That's, that's almost you, the middle of you. Know, that's, not, that's almost all of right. them. That's yeah. almost the middle. If we go by if we go by the scripture, you know, well, that's all we can go by. <laughs> that's all we better go by. <laughs> but yet, and still, uh, they just got a yeah. They just on a yeah. little small little pot, and, and and not completely in control of that because the Muslims are there on that land. Look at the strip. Mm -hmm. They fighting over the Gaza Strip. It's just like they say. It's they just strip. a little strip of land, just a small sliver of land. Yeah. That so much blood has been shed. Yeah. Because of well. The reason they say that uh, that they they hate Israel because they've been uh, relegated to a small plot of land with uh, ocean boxes made on one end and Israel won't let them come across the other end <laughs> and so they have no way out. <laughs> they is what they call it, a consecration treasure yeah, camp. Yeah, right, right, that's yeah. what they call it, you know. And we, and we that's why we're so angry. That's what the guy said. We're angry because they done boxed us in here and uh, and uh, we can't and to get out of here. We got to go through their gates. Yeah. You know, and get permission from them. So, you know, there's all kind of excuses as to why, 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 why. Let me read a little bit of this, brother. I'm going to read quickly. Well, we got a lot to talk about here. Um, uh, the, the title of this article here is God Chosen People of Destiny. Uh, the, the, tonight, the history of our salvation is extricably bound up in the history of God's chosen people of destiny. In that is the Jews. That's why many years ago, when a great Bible conference speaker was asked to prove the inspiration of Scripture in one sentence, he replied, I do it in one word. The Jews. <laughs> the Jews. One nation on earth was picked by God to be what, brother? The bearer of the truth? Amen. The begetters of the line of the Amen. Messiah Amen. is his blessing to all, all nations. All nations. The rest right. of the, that's a lot of responsibility. Yeah. 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 Huh? Get yeah. what you got? I got a scripture. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. In Genesis 12, 2, it says, uh -huh. And I will make of thee a great nation. A great nation, yes. And I will bless thee. Mm. And make thy name great. Name great. And thou shalt be a blessing. That's the promise he made to Abraham. Make thy name great. It, it wasn't, made, you didn't see a clause in there say, if y'all obey me constantly no. all the time? <laughs> no. Uh, and, and even Paul reminds <laughs> reminds them in Romans. What, Romans what, 4. That? what did he say? Romans 4, 20, he said, he staggered, talking about Abraham, he staggered mm -hmm. not at the promise of God. Wait, wait, unbelief. wait. He staggered not. 
Okay, uh, okay, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. He staggered okay. not at the promise of God through unbelief, mm. but was strong in faith, giving glory, glory to God, God mm. and being fully persuaded mm -hmm. that what He had promised. He was made. See, that's what it's all. That's what it's all about. The promise that, that was made to a man. And that correlates with us in our lives. Absolutely. 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 Mm -hmm. And he, he, he told them. And in one scripture too, okay, he told them one scripture. He didn't choose them because they was a big, mighty, 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 mighty. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Couple, they were the smallest of all. That's yeah. right. And that rolls right over to our salvation, though. Yeah. Amen. Uh, the kinship of our salvation. Well, mm -hmm. well, see, the promise, and that, that's the beauty of even the promise that God gives us. It's not predicated on anything oh, we do. Okay. If it was, okay. the promise to Abraham would have been null and void when oh. Abraham made that man. Yeah. <laughs> you know, with, with Ishmael and, and Hagar, when he when they made those choices, wouldn't that nullify the promise if they had in it? If they had um, any in the hold up, that's right. That's, and that's, that's another right. reason right. He, he cut getting it down to three hundred million. Anymore, thousands and thousands of men. In the way, the and principle and is there all the way around, ain't That's it? That's right. All the way through the Bible, threaded with that yeah. same principle, right there, yeah. not because of you. Mm -hmm. But because of my sovereign choice. Well, when he could swear on nothing greater, he told by himself. Go, Campbell. What Milk just said, Deuteronomy 7 7. The Lord did not set it. his love upon you, right. nor choose you because you were more in number okay. than any people. Okay. For you were the fewest of all people. But because the Lord loved you, mm -hmm. and because he would keep the oath, Okay, the oath. He, promise, had, promise, he, promise. he would keep the oath which had sworn unto your fathers. Mm, Abraham. Abraham. There you go. <laughs> Hath the Lord brought you out with a mighty hand and redeemed you out of the house of bondmen from the hand of Pharaoh, king of Egypt. That's why he did it. He loved you and made a promise to your fathers, mm -hmm. which is Abraham. That, that's but it. He, but even though you were disobedient, he yeah. didn't rescind that promise, did he? No. Mm -hmm. He whipped your tail. Right. Yeah. And keep it, uh, keep he it whipped, going. He whipped your tail real good. <laughs> That's right. Real good. Uh, but he did not take back. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No. Amen. No. So God is the same yesterday yeah. and today and forever, baby. I God, pray everybody hear that, Paul. God you know, never changes, do it. Absolutely. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So Absolutely. he still mean he still what he said then. Yeah, he still mean. That promise still stands today. Yes, that. yes. But they had a gay parade over there this past year. So? So? <laughs> what did that make? That's the only gay... The, the, the promise no. he made? The promise he made. I mean, you're going to get a whipping still. Yeah, 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 okay. yeah, absolutely. You want me coming. Okay. Right. Uh, right, bro. Let's look a little, little bit further. The Jewish people are God's people. The Jewish customs are God's shadow, just a shadow, of mm -hmm. things even yet to come. Israel and the miracle of God's work in and through them is the second great key to God's prophetic roadmap for the future. Mm. The Lord has claimed that he alone can declare the future. Mm. I am God, and there is none like me. Amen. De I can declare the end from the beginning. Huh? And from ancient times, the things that are not yet done. That's Isaiah 46, 10, 9, and 10. Mm -hmm. huh? We have also, uh, St. Peter, a, a more sure word of prophecy. Oh, man, there you go. A sure word. Sure word. You can, you can, you can stand on it. You can, you can stand on it. Today, right now. Well, 24? Yeah. Well, let me, let me, let me do you one better. Mm -hmm. If you're standing on anything else, you're in trouble. Yeah. Hmm. See, that's why we can say the revelations of God's plan. That, I mean, they, they're sure. They, Absolutely. Past and future. Absolutely, Even with bro. the prophecies, he done, they done prophesied. Mm -hmm. Some of them have already been fulfilled. Oh, a lot and of the others are going to be fulfilled. Doing revelation right. time. Yeah, do, yeah. When, the, when the book of Revelation comes to full bloom. Well, bro. Yeah. It's our hope that keeps us going. That's it. Some of, us, some of them are being fulfilled right, right now. now. Right through now. us. Right through, through the ones who are here right, right now. Right now. Right now. Sure. Pastor called it a true. blessed hope. It ain't blessed hope. It ain't well. I hope he come to work. It's mm -hmm. it's a it's a mm -hmm. it's a certain thing of the future. It's yes. certain. Yes, we yes. know. Yes. It's in the That's future. That's what makes it's it blessed. It's yes. gonna happen. Right. And we got it right before our eyes, but we don't believe it today. <laughs> But that's that, that that sure word. We got it right, right here, right. everywhere, everywhere, Playing out. And, and everywhere. Out. Uh, but yet it's like, still, man, what just completely destroyed, you know? Well, that's why. That's why uh, Moses and it was the people that were with Moses didn't enter into the promised land what? because they, that's why they perished in the wilderness. Yeah, because of their unbelief. Their unbelief. The same thing today. Mm -hmm. 
When that about y'all funny, that, that old book, y'all believe that. I'm dating. That's what they say. I'm dating. Antiquated. That's what they call it. They use yeah. big words. It's antiquated. Antiquated. That's right. All right. What happened uh, to Israel has been ordained? Mm-hmm. That's pretty heavy there, ain't it? Huh? By God. 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 And we need to be careful to understand from the past dealing of God with the Jews to realize in the future that he is still at work. First, we must see that God has chosen the Jews as his people. First. Amen. Amen. To understand the that. whole world needs to understand that. Yeah. These people are favored by God. Mm-hmm. That's first. He, first. First. You gotta understand that. First now. And, and, and we, he loves us, even though we kind of like stepchildren in a way. <laughs> yeah. But, but he still, <laughs> he still loves us. We're adopted. We're adopted. We're, we're, we've been grafted in. I don't I mean, mind at all. Now, that's, just get me in. Oh, huh? this thing. You just don't care when you're a step or whatever. First, we must see that God has chosen the Jews as his people. Secondly, and God has chosen the land. That's right. Now this the big this this where a lot of the fighting the battle come from right here the land the land it ain't about them leaving mm-hmm. and them squatting on it no mm-hmm. it's, it never was your no. it never actually was. Okay. it's God's yeah actually, that's actually, why they want it <laughs> actually it's God's land mm-hmm. and He has said He want a certain people to be on it and that's it yeah well that's all that's well, the whole thing the argument would be y'all was disobedient and God kicked y'all off that land so y'all forfeited. Right. All the return, but now Lord said they would return, didn't he? Wait a didn't he say he would bring them back? Absolutely. Absolutely. That's a part of the prophecy. Yeah. My pastor, but even though y'all were disobedient and God kicked y'all off that land, yeah. he didn't bring you on it. <laughs> right, okay. Who, what, how did they squat it? You mean the people, after God kicked his people <laughs> out of the, off the land, uh-huh. and the land was kind of left open more oh, than they came you mean the squatters came in and, yeah. right. and squatted on the land. Okay. okay. And then when God, uh, 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 by his uh, grace or mercy, uh, saw fit in 47, the year I was born, that they came back into came that back. land. Yeah. Whether they came by uh, against the will, because everything. I ain't no against the will. Okay, that don't, yeah. Hit me (laughs) Yeah, yeah, yeah. ain't that having nothing against the will. Everything happened by the will. Come on. Okay, so now when they they came back, yes, that was a tug of war. The Palestinian people, or whatever they call themselves, they were pushed. A lot of work pushed out of that main land. Yeah, and they were pushed down in that little strip. And that's that's right. right. That little strip. Yeah. And uh, cause now, like I say, they 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 said that we were here first, but they wasn't there first. No, no, no. no. Uh, no. Who was there first? Israel was there first. That's right. right. Huh? That's right. And uh, and and, and, and cause you had some uh, candidates in there really first. Right. If yeah. you want to look at before all that, and before God pushed them out. God pushed them out. Purge the land. He said he's going to push him out. Yeah. Uh, Kevin, what you got now? Jeremiah 30. Jeremiah 30. Verse 3. Mm-hmm. For lo, the days come, saith the Lord, that I will bring again the captivity of my people, Israel and Judah, mm-hmm. saith the and Lord. Judah. I will cause them to return to the land that I gave oh, to their fathers, and they shall, shall possess, possess it. Yeah. They shall possess it. They you shall. mean I can't unpossess it? <laughs> If God doesn't possess, gave you the possession of it, there's no way that I can. No I mean, way, I can shoot every rocket in the world. I no can, matter who owns it, no matter who owns it, you got it. Don't belong to you. It don't belong to you. Mm-mm. And that's that's what it's all about, right? That's what it's about. That's, that's the promise. If He made it 20, 30, 50 years ago, okay. it's gonna come to pass. It's still hope. It's still hope. It's the right now. Still and still this, the, this the thing we have: world leaders. Who okay. are in dire conflict about dividing the land that don't belong to none of them. That's right. That's right. That's, right. That's right. right now. World leaders yeah. that don't belong to none of them. Mm-hmm. 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 So basically, when we come down to the, the nitty gritty of the whole situation, is that this is the battle. Uh, is, what did the Lord tell uh, uh, Moses? Uh, you know, uh, 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 no, it wasn't Moses. It was Joshua. Joshua. Well, he told them, don't take it personal. He told a couple of them, a couple of, a couple of the prophets, don't, don't, it's not you. It's not you. Yeah, it's, it's, right, right, right. it's not you that they yeah. really are against. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, so right. don't, don't take this personal, please. He told Jeremiah, don't even look at their face. <laughs> right. Right. It's me. It's me. It's me. Right. They, what is that? They didn't reject you. They yeah, reject what? Even yeah. Jesus said it. Yeah. Well, they really don't hate you. It's not you. Well, no. They, oh. well, they hate you. The only reason they hate you is because they hate me. Because of me. And we, if we name the name of Christ, you mean we gonna be we gonna be hated in our gonna hate you, man. Well, I'm but you want everybody to like you, don't you? They gonna hate you, brother. Everybody, brother, y'all you, already hated. Everybody, everybody gonna, 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 gonna hate you. Man. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. already hate. And the more Jesus you stick out there, the more you will be, the more you will be hated. Yeah, you can try to say, "Tell like, like told Peter, you talk like one of them." Yeah, yeah. Uh, he what? Yeah, you yeah. 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 Well, can I be an undercover Christian? And no, no, no such thing. You're no. gonna be covered up at the first time you try to be covered up. You're gonna be uncovered. Exposed. What, what do you say? Exposed. 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 What you got? What's your no, speech no, no. betrayed. <laughs> your your speech favorite speech. That's what they say. Your favorite speech. You talk like one of them. Well, how they talk, though, did she recognize the, the dialect? How about righteous? Probably certain things that uh, they said that most people didn't agree with. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? <laughs> they know that's a, that's a brother? Hey, true. what's up, bro? No, everybody, no. everybody, everybody called these days. No, right now, right now, but we originated it, though. We come, <laughs> come on, y'all, a little bit more. Let's get a little bit more of this here. Number two. Number two. Uh, and God has chosen the land of Canaan, not Palestine. Okay. Palestine. Or Philistine. Or Philistine, the same thing, right? Mm -hmm. As his land. And God has chosen the destiny of the nation of Israel as his destined plan for his destined people. Now, that's heaven there. Yeah, yeah. That's heaven there. Destined people. Destined means it's a destination. It's an end to this. It's, it's, it's a place they're going. Yeah, it's predetermined. It's he, destined. Well, I can give you a strong word. Okay. God has decreed it. Yeah. Oh, okay. boy. Right. It's a decree. Okay. Got to have. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, can't, got can't, to. Can't, 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 can't go back on it. Can't go back. As we read the newspaper, see how intense the hatred is of Israel by her enemies. Even the continued existence of the Jews after centuries of dispersal and persecution, unique in human history. Their continuous existence is a mute but eloquent testimony Just to fulfill prophecy. Yeah, ain't that that right. they still yeah, that's here. True. The, just the simple fact that they still in existence. A small group of people. That's right. Yeah. Not just in existence, but but thriving. Yeah. yeah. Thriving. In yeah. existence and thriving. In the midst of opposition. So much opposition. Yeah. yeah. The numbers are still not very large, but the impact yeah. on culture and society on the world sure. is larger than the world. world. Really, on the world. On the world. On the world. Because they have, they, they, God imparted some great wisdom to them. Uh, let's go a little further here. Uh, the the, the, the um, restoration of Israel as a nation among nations is, in our own generation, is merely the most recent in a long time of fulfilled prophecy long dealing line, with yeah. long line of uh, fulfilled prophecy dealing with the Jewish people. Jewish people. Yeah. Through the history, through the Holy Scriptures, almost all written by the Jews, almost all, and through Jesus Christ, the seed of Abraham has indeed become a blessing to all families of the earth, just like God said he would, right? Mm -hmm. Some from every nation have found salvation and blessing through faith in him. In him. One, number three, of the strong evidence of divine inspiration of the Bible, not found in other religious books that either past or present, consists of its hundreds of fulfilled prophecies. Mm -hmm. Hmm? Do y'all realize how important it was Christ said we must fulfill all prophecies. Mm -hmm. yeah. Huh? yeah. In other words, everything that was said is we'll mentioned. Christ fulfilled everything but that which Revelation says gonna have to happen. Yeah. Yeah. It's gonna fulfill itself. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah, oh yeah. He coming back. Yeah, he'll fulfill all that. I think during the thousand year millennium that dog people don't believe in it, but uh the Bible seemed to teach something like that to me. I don't know about you guys. Oh, yeah. tell a thousand years, absolutely. Huh? On rain, a thousand. That's like that's like when, after the uh, trip. That's like when Christ got up and read in the in the synagogue and he closed the book. He was letting them know then the prophecy has been fulfilled. Right, me right. you here. Me right. 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 standing up right here now, yeah. reading this word has yeah. been fulfilled. Yeah. Right, right now, what he yeah. right now. He closed the book. We yeah, must like fulfill. That. We must fulfill all righteousness. Must fulfill. Huh? Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. Go ahead and go ahead and, 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 and backstab me, brother. We got to do what the Bible says. That's do. right. All the way down to his baptism. All the way down. Yeah. He didn't need to be. He didn't have sin. John said, I'm, I'm not worthy. And he was right, but still, <laughs> it had to be done. <laughs> Prophesied. Mm. The word had to be fulfilled. That shows us the, the, the power of God's word, right? Yeah. It How shows the is. faithfulness of God, too. Right. Oh. I mean, Right we may not understand what we're doing, and they may be like, Jesus, where you got to go over that? Man, this is one of the steps. We have to do it this, this way. way, step by step. That's why even even some of the, the sacraments he left for, for us in the church, they like baptism. Yeah. It's very important. Yeah. Not to your salvation. Right. No, no. But no, to yeah. your obedience. 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 Yeah, it's, yeah. A, it's very 
very important. Yeah. And everyone who's been saved by the grace of God should be baptized. Should be baptized. If you've really been saved, you yeah. should be baptized. And then not only that, you should uh, take partake in the Lord's Supper also. That's right. Come on, a little bit further. Now. We're going to go a little further. Prophecy about the Jews. Uh, uh, did I stop there? Yeah. But just a moment, try to feel the impact of these observations. Now, prophecy is about the Jews, their history, their suffering, their suffering, their uh, rebirth as a nation, the future destiny God has mapped out for his chosen people. Destiny has been a matter of public record on the page of scripture and available for Catholic examination uh, for centuries, all down through the newspapers and everything else. Uh, that they have been fulfilled in specific details cannot be the result of mere chance, but is a fact more than sufficient proof of the existence of the God who inspired the Bible and of that book authenticity and errancy. Right. In view of such clear and overwhelming evidence, one can only characteristically assume that no agnostic or atheist has bothered to read the biblical prophecies and check them personally against history. They must not, because they see how I mean. Well, Pastor, it's it's what the Bible said. There's something about because that wouldn't help you for me. Yeah, that oh, wouldn't help. It wouldn't help. suppressing the truth. The one come back from the dead. Yeah, you still yeah. wouldn't believe. So they ain't gonna believe that uh, reading the no, history. How no, history? No, 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 none of that. None of that. Going in. None of that. None of that. Okay. That's why it's a gift from God. It is okay. So I mentioned it's a gift from God. So he, you said that he truly opened our understanding. That's right. It enlightened us. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's right. Until the Lord opened your eyes. Come on, bro. You blind. You see, yeah. You blind. You see, when we say when we tell people the Lord has enlightened us, they think of the uh, the Renaissance area. Well, well, all them brothers who've been enlightened, them crazy philosophers, yeah, smoking that yeah. good weed and all that. <laughs> that good weed. That's how they were enlightened. And then get off stage and yeah. buster. Yeah, you know, yeah, and, yeah, yeah, philosophize. Well, I give yeah. a gal. Yeah. We used to do that in the hood. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Get on the corner, man. Oh, oh, and you were wise. wise. You were wise. You were here to tell something. You on the corner, there, man. Yeah. Like, you you drink enough of that fire water. And <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, modern Israel only occupies about one sixth mm. of a percent of per one, one percent six. of the land area which the Arabs possess. In other words, they only own one sixth of the land. Yeah. They got no, they only that. they only occupy it. occupy it. occupy. It. There you go. Israel there only you occupies go. Go. one sixth of the land that God gave. That's them. right. To Abraham. Right. Is that right? Yeah. Man, one you got six it. of one percent. One six of the eight number. Well, you know, just like you said, the Bible, the way the Bible laid the land out. Yeah. yeah. That's just about all of the Middle East. That's all of it. So yeah, I can see that. <laughs> what they call the Israel now, that little old splotch yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That ain't one six of, of, so, of so, a so what we're saying is according to the word of God, everybody else is squatters. That's right. Yeah, that's right. All these other guys that are fighting and carrying on squads. Maybe that's why they so angry. It ain't but one thing. On somebody else it ain't but one thing I disagree with you saying. What, what, that? Said, what, that I think, what I think? You said so. What we saying? No. Okay. That's what we repeat. Okay. Okay. We just repeat. That's what okay. we repeat. Okay. That's what the Bible says. That's said. what it words okay. say. Okay. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm hiding behind my brother. I ain't. Yeah. I don't want to jump out there. I'm hiding behind my brother. So, so don't put my word out there. No. No. Don't you okay. Come on now. One percent. Is that one? Uh, one six of one percent of the land area which the Arab now, but the Arab nations have all. Yeah. Man, they're going up in Saudi Arabia, man. Yeah. They got all. They got wealth. Worldwide influence with such seemingly inexhaustible resources command at their command. Israel's postage stamp piece of land. Postage stamp. Yeah. That's what it is. So all that land Arabs have now should be the Jews. Should be Israel. Yeah, should be Israel. With, uh, with those resources. Right, right. Huh? It is. But God, <laughs> they pushed them into a little bit of crammed in a little bit of area. Yeah. yeah. And yet God blessing them on a the desert like Come on, man. Come the on. They, had all that other, they feed, hey, they happen to feed the rest of the world from that little bit of blotch of, of, of land they got over there. See, when you think of when you think about the land, Kevin, you when you think about the scripture where he tells them how many kings that he defeated for. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. King of Bashan, and Amorite. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He went down, down the line. Just that's for them. That, yeah. That's the land. That's all that land. That all that land. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And just think, you know, this is what I always thought about. I, I consider this all the time. You know, whether it's German, whether it's Russia, or whether it's Ukraine, or all them other nations, 
the brilliant scientists are all Jews. Okay. They live in Russia. They were in yeah. Germany during Hitler's time. It, oh, am I right about that? Yeah. Engineers, uh, sci scientists, uh, yeah, chemists. The mm -hmm. And even though the Germans, yeah. the Germans hated them, but they needed them because they, they were used them. They did. They yeah. used them. They, huh? were, they would kidnap them and yeah. make them work for them. Absolutely. Them. And they still doing that kind of stuff. Absolutely. Right now today. So God blessed them not only with land, he blessed them with the brilliance. Yeah. And with knowledge. Yeah. 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 They say now that uh, Israel is uncovering some weapons now that America's sitting back and wondering where they get that from. Huh? I'm talking about they pulled out some big guns <laughs> well, that they want America in that side. They've, all, they've always had a lot of those things, like a lot of the cures for a lot of things that come about, come out yeah. of Israel. Come out of Israel. Okay. Come right out of Israel. Okay. okay. You know, and this ain't putting them on a pedestal. Y'all, no, I'm, no, 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 I'm praising God because well, God, he's, he's the orchestrator of all this, of, of why it's going down, how it's going down, mm -hmm. and he's definitely the orchestrator on how it's going to go down. Sure. Sure, but he showed God showed even way back yonder. God showed the, the all the uh, nations around Israel how much they needed these people. They are blessing too. Mm -hmm. They are blessing mm -hmm. yeah. to every nation. Yeah. And God showed that uh, even though they hated them, they needed them. <laughs> well, yeah. Pastor, the Bible gives us record of all that even when they went. To, to conquer a city. What 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 Rahab tell them? Oh, we heard about it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, just we, we know y'all God's people, and we 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 afraid. They know it today, bro. We they heard we it. heard what y'all God done. That's right. And I, 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 I we ain't got that yet. Yeah, yeah. We ain't got that yet. Too long before they even arrive. Yeah. I asked the guy. I said, uh, wow. I said, now how is it that even in America, you know, we got a lot of Jews and and they uh, a lot of them fit the rich. Yeah, huh? they are. Soros has got some Jew blood in him, some kind of way. But now, why is that? Why is it that they hate? Uh, they don't. They hate the Jews, and they are Jew themselves. He didn't know what he told me. He said, "Those Haman's people came out. No, whoever came out with them. <laughs> they came out with the Jews, but they came out of Egypt and mixed money. They mixed both Jews. Jews. Yeah. They mixed yeah. Both Jews. yeah, they came. They were raised up in the Jewish thing, but they never were. Yeah, true. Jewish. Go ahead, Kim. Get in there. Go ahead, jump, jump, jump. This is what uh, Mel said that just gives you an idea of what mm -hmm. this land that should be possessed by the Jews look like. Okay. He okay. said, now these are the kings of the land which the children of Israel smote and possessed their land. Their land. Okay. On uh -huh. the other side of Jordan toward the rising of the sun. The other side of Jordan. From the river Arnon unto the mount of Hermon and That's all the plains of the east. All the plains of the, the, plains of the plains. east. Come on, Pastor. I told you. That's the Middle East. That's just about all the land over there. Well, Netanyahu, Net 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 he said, it's a possibility we ain't giving back the Gaza to no control or nobody. We'll let the people stay, but we're going to control it, though. Oh. That's what he said. That's what he said. And, 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 and you said here that he ought to take all of it here, not just that little strip oh, now. Huh? Yeah. 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 Huh? They've been cut off from the waterway. All these years, cause Gaza got most of the water coast, right? Yeah. And he said, "We ain't giving up that we water coast no up. more. We ain't not gonna do it no more, huh?" Yeah, but, but, it, oh boy, God's working, ain't it? God's he working. Is. God's he working. Is. All right, where, where did that stop? Modern, modern, modern Israel. Hmm? Modern Israel only comprises one ten, one one six of one percent of the land. Uh, Every day, Arabs, uh, the Arab nation have all the wealth, worldwide influence. So it seemingly any cause more. Uh, Israel's postage stamp piece of land. <laughs> Scarce. Scarcely yeah. discernible oh, on the whole world, world map. Yeah. Oh, wow. Lord. And it like all the essentials to make it the center of oh, worldwide right. concern. But it is. But, but it, it is. is. But it is. But it is. Huh? They tried to cut them off. Man. Man. They cut them off from the oil. They cut them off from everything. Yeah. But still, 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 worry still. about it. Word of devil. What what is that God, brothers? Yes, it is. Yeah. Can we say it can huh? Is that God what, working? What, what would a what would a, a, a so called big country like Iran be worried hey. about yeah. little old Israel? Yeah, be worried about little Israel. Mm -hmm. Ain't that something a little gnat compared to a Goliath? Why why would yeah. they Huh? Why do they okay, okay, okay. If it wasn't a God thing, bro, if it wasn't why God would you feel the need a country as big as Iran, Turkey, okay, okay. Russia, Turkey, yeah. why would you feel the need to come together with these two go okay. to war? Oh, this little this little why post this thing. When one of y'all is, is sufficient enough for this little country, why y'all know something? Why y'all cowards got to come together? Somebody knows something though. <laughs> 
Somebody so, knows something. They know they did it with a gold eye. They know they've been up walking up in there with that little pewter it, on it, 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 it's like I'm on a, it's like I want to I want to jump on pastor but I got to go get Tony and kill. Yeah. I'm, 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 I'm going to get my big bro. That's it. That's it. And I'm just a little skinny little fellow. You know, and you looking like a little uh, uh, Hercules down there. <laughs> okay, let me go over here. Yet in the fine. Huh? Yet in the fine. Yet in the fine. Oh, yet in the fine for all reasons, however. Mm -hmm. Israel is the focus on what? World, World attention. attention. Precisely as prophesied. Huh? God's God, 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 the That's talk right. of the town. That's right. And they are. Next within Israel, consider the city, uh, that consider that city the entire world has heard of Jerusalem. Mm -hmm. Jerusalem is a small city. Neither commercial nor strategic location. Mm -hmm. When the Old Testament prophet wrote of the future, they did so with precision. Mm -hmm. Their astonishing accuracy singled out Jerusalem as the world's focus. They didn't say Damascus, okay. Cairo. London, London, Paris, or Paris would become the center of action in the last day. But they said, what? Jerusalem. Yet the eyes of the world are upon it as upon no other city. Yeah, that's right. Boy, that's a prophecy. Yeah. Jerusalem is indeed a burdensome stone. Zechariah <laughs> <laughs> 12. He called Israel a burdensome stone. Zechariah 12, 1 through 3. Around the necks mm. of all nations of the world. The most vexing and volatile problem the United Nations faces today. A little bit, a little bit That's right. like that. That's right. Well, it got everybody in the uproar. That's right. <laughs> That's right. Huh? Look, look. Like he said, he said the most vexing yeah. and the most volatile. volatile. Yeah, yeah, volatile. Yeah, problem. Uh, that powder king. Their problem. That's a powder king. <laughs> Look like there's just a net you can just step on and just keep on moving. Look like it. Huh? Huh? You better not pick your foot up. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go a little further here. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, there is no ordinary explanation for this. But the Hebrew prophet declared thousands of years ago, y'all. Mm -hmm. And what seemed, seemed ugly, fantastic in their time is being fulfilled in our day. Right now. Right now. Right now. That's right. This is the only part of the evidence, as we shall see, that the prophesied last days are upon us and that our generation would like to see the remainder of the Bible prophecy fulfilled. We're in the midst of it, brother. Mm -hmm. There are so many more specific prophetic uh, passages to be fulfilled in the last days based on the prophecies which have already come true. We must conclude that these two will literally unfold. In the not too distant future. That's right. That's right. Huh? That's Thus, God right. had declared that the most appalling time of utter destruction, both for Jews and for the entire population of the world, lies yet ahead. Mm -hmm. That's true. That's true. We ain't seen nothing yet. I'm talking right. about. I'm talking about a catastrophic. Uh, yeah, it's oh, coming. coming. It's coming. I, I hate to say it, it's but it's coming. It, it, it's going. But here's the safe part about it, is, brother. I'm not exempt. No, no. You're not exempt. No, no. None of us. But we got a home to go come to. Come on, man. Right. Yeah, what I'm to saying. be absent from the body. Present with the Lord. I ain't talking about next week. <laughs> all this. I'm not talking about uh, Pastor, all this destruction, all this stuff we talk about here in this lesson. Yeah. Uh -huh. Is the key to my new home. Oh, mm. praise God. Mm. Yes. It's the key yeah. to my new house. Yeah. yeah. You mean yeah. all this destructive raggedy ship, you gonna ride home? They're remodeling. They remodeling. That's all they're doing. Remodeling. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, glory, boy, you got boy, you looking at the thing that I'm not seeing. Oh, like I said, throw me in the breath. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Sweet home, Lord. Sweet home, sweet home. Yes, Lord. Look at a little bit more of it now. Uh uh to speak uh, in biblical terms, God says, watch out. Okay. The time of Jacob's trouble. That's, that's tribulation, brother. Mm -hmm. Jeremiah 37 spells danger and misery for the, the entire land. And I wish people would understand that Ooh, and realize. Yeah. And quit don't your hope. get better, miss. Yeah, don't build your hope upon this this life here. This life here. Huh? Because, it, I mean, we it's obvious if you look around you that... Uh, <laughs> It's a fatal mistake to build your hope upon this land. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, it's deteriorating. It's going down. It's going down. Yes, but yet it's still, people still plan their future building. 30 years from now, I want to be able to buy my own house. You know what I got in my 401k? <laughs> yeah, I know what you got. Yeah. You, better, you better hope it stay there. <laughs> you, better hope, you better hope it stay there. Uh, 
And then if you, uh, one, <laughs> one guy said he make a run on the bank and everybody put the money in the, in, 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 in the box, you know. Yeah, there ain't no need. Yeah. Ain't, ain't no help, need. Ain't no help, not it's gonna, all of it's gonna burn up. The vault well, gonna burn up. <laughs> But there's gonna come a time when hey, we see it now. We see it now. Your dollar ain't worth what? What your dollar? Ain't nothing. Worth? Nothing. Your dollar now, milk ain't worth a dime. Ain't worth a dime, man. Huh? So you're gonna get worse and worse. Well, absolutely. Well, that, that we read, uh, uh, we saw somewhere uh, on YouTube, maybe somewhere. Well, in history, where they had the money, but uh, they, 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 it wasn't worth a dime, and they had, they, they had a wheelbarrow full of money. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. They had money stacked there. Well, exactly, but it wasn't worth nothing. They, they. They said, got one guy said we can use it for toilet paper. Well, that's what they were doing with a lot of uh, making fires with the money. It wasn't no good. It, and, and, and that could happen very easily. It's you know, happening. Yeah. You, think, you think about the Great Depression when you read about how they, they oh, made yeah. them bring all their gold and everything and turn it in. Yeah. You know, yeah, yeah. I mean, it, 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 time it's is just, just, just like that. It's just, See, like, just that. like that. See, currency, uh -huh. that's why the Bible teach outside of food and raiment. Be, be what? Don't 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 be worried about the rest That's of this right. stuff. Because, that. because man declares the value. Put the value up on what? Of, of items and, and currency and all that. <laughs> you know, make me think about what I told you earlier about my officer said that work at Wales Fargo and, and the folks with the big accounts, More they worry about money. 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 Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. See, see folks like us, we 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 ain't worried about I ain't got nothing money. to worry about me. <laughs> <laughs> So the poor Indian your boy got there playing catch ball with with with, with, with gold and just throw it around on the ground. Look at that. It don't mean nothing to them. While I'm sitting out there in the while I'm sitting out there in the while I'm sitting out there in the middle of the woods, I'm seeing God's deal and turkey running everywhere. Everywhere. I already know. The provision is there. Yeah. Oh yeah. When Dixie shut your doors. Yeah. I mean, that's all right. When Dixie shut your doors. That's all right with me. I can go to Tony House, man. Yeah, come on, come on, bro. But I'm, I'm saying, those are the things that matter. People don't yeah. stop long enough to think that when Dixie get that chicken breast you had last night, it came from the same place. Yeah. But that's so yeah. discouraging to people that are planning their future right now, bro. Yeah. Don't you know that. <laughs> why you want to be a kill of y'all that? Wait, 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 wait. Now, don't you know some people planning their lives now? Their future. Just because you got to be an old fuddy duddy. Yeah. Why, 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 why you got to? Why you got to? I'm, 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 like, I'm like Uncle Don told me. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm just a realist. So don't, 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 I'm just a realist. Go, <laughs> <laughs> uh, go. You can't go to jam one. Oh, no. Okay. All right, let me more here, y'all. Yeah. Because I'm time to get on again. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Before we look at our before text. we look at our text tonight, we, we let let me just read you read to you an incredible summary of all uh, uh, specifics uh, God has revealed about His chosen people of destiny to you. Just listen and soak these in. Now we will actually look at them one by one in the scriptures as we go tonight. I'm going fast with these, but uh, remember what I teach today is usually online by Monday, blah, 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 blah. Discover the uh, book of ministry. Yeah. God identified his chosen people that destiny, uh, destiny as the Jews, descendants of Abraham. They are called oh, what? Israel. They are called Israel. Israel. God picked one man Ur, uh, out of Ur of the Kachardis, That's right. Asked him to walk a hundred miles, hundred of miles through the desert to a land filled with what, brother? Powerful, Powerful king, king of states. states. And there in a series of revelations, the Almighty God of the universe solemnly swore that this, to this man, this man, one man, a nation, one man now, one man, a nation would descend from him, from him. Then let the man get a hundred years old before he even started. <laughs> read, 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 read the fin of that song. Okay, okay, okay. Go ahead. So, to him. this man, a nation would descend from him that would be the chosen people of destiny. These people are the Jewish people. These people are today the Israelites. These people are today God's people. Amen. Hmm? Today. Amen. Today. Today. Shouldn't we have a little bit of respect for that? Yes. Yeah. No, you should have all the respect for that, Pastor. Mm -hmm. Because that's the truth. That's it, what's it, true. It is the truth. It is true. God promised to give a land now to his chosen people. And that's what they dispute about. They say over there is the land. Uh, to his chosen people of destiny to Jew with clearly defined boundaries. To Abraham. To Abraham. He gave it. He gave, gave it. it. He gave, gave it clearly. clearly. Abraham knew all the way to where the land stopped it, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. He renewed that promise to Abraham's son Isaac, to his grandson Jacob, and to their descendants after them forever. Uh, yeah. yeah. Three, God promised to bring his chosen people of destiny to the promised land. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. It is a historical fact that God brought these chosen people into the promised land. An amazing story of miracles in itself. In itself. In itself. God promised to judge his chosen people of death if they forgot him. And they will. Did it, and he in did. the promised land. That's and right. He did. did he have them rejected? He told That's them. right. Taken to a foreign land. That's right. Scattered. Locked up. Scattered. Yep. And scattered. That's how they got. Is that how they got to be in Russian? Russian Jews, mm -hmm. German Jews. God, they read, read them. They gonna tell you you gonna get it okay. all that. Look. When the Jewish people entered the Promised Land, uh, God warned them that if they practice idolatry, mm -hmm. oh boy, and immorality, oh boy, like the United States man. of that of the land previous in heaven, be like the rest of them, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. Whom he had destroyed for their evil, he would cast them out as well. That's why they got out of there. That's right. That's why they had to come back in 47, is what you're saying. Yeah. Huh? God put them out. That's right. His people? Yeah. Well, how can you be your people and you put them out? He loved them. They, is that love? That's love. Yes. 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 That's God right. done took you out of your house <laughs> and put you out in, in somebody else's uh, prison. Right. That's he, love. He, ain't love. Let you, he didn't let you run headlong into that wall when you were there. That's right, bro. When, when, when Mama done tore us up, they said, this, this gonna hurt me more than hurt you. Yeah, yeah. They I ain't must never, got that from God. I ain't never believe that, dude. I ain't never believe that. But they must but, got that from God, though. But I'm glad when I understood it. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> they had to get that fair feeling from God. Yeah, absolutely. He said he cast him out. That, that that this would happen is again an indisputable fact of history. It did happen, right? God promised to scatter his faithful uh, but chosen people of destiny for, for, from the promised land. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, God declared that his people would be scattered among all people. Oh, from one end of the Jews, earth. German Jews, he did it, Russian too. Jews, he Ukraine Jews. Oh, I mean, they were everywhere. 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 Huh? Mm -hmm. God promised that you scattered them. Okay, among it. Okay. Uh, what, uh, and so it happened. The one of the Jews is found what? Everywhere. Everywhere. God promised a curse upon his unfaithful but, but chosen, chosen people of the There you go. As they wandered the world without their promised land mm. for thousands of years. So that's how them squatters got in there. Sure. That's right. Sure. They left vacant. Sure. Purposely. Left vacant. And and and, and, and cause now look at it. Look at it from the standpoint. Them people that have been on that land for thousands of years. Right. Those squat, what we call squatters, yeah. what the Bible would call squatters yeah. too. It'll build the houses. Yeah. Raise yeah. their family. Yeah. Now what them Jews not coming back here talking about they gonna come back here? Well, then, then God promised them that day at some point Return. They, were, they were gonna live well, they were gonna live the house that they ain't built and eat yeah, them I, I don't believe that though, Tony. I don't believe that because if God promised to bring them back, then when they got back and knocked on the door, the people would have said, Y'all come back home. <laughs> We've well, been waiting on y'all. Waiting on y'all. Hey, Ray, 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 he said, we looked out for God, people. Yeah. He told us we could stay here. Me and my family. <laughs> so it ain't true that if God wanted them to come back, they would, he would put on the heart of those people that occupied the land to say, we knew that they were going to come. Yeah, y'all come on. I knew y'all come, come on in. And we moving out. We moving the bar. Y'all y'all <laughs> come. Here, you all truck. Yeah, we moving the bar. Uh, it didn't happen like that, did it? No. No, they killed a lot of them. A lot right. of so-called Palestinian people. They, 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 they died. Then they did take that land. They took the houses, brother. They didn't take that, yeah. that land. It wasn't that land. Yeah. Right. Few more, few more, brother. We're gonna we gonna give some remarks to close out here. Uh where, where was I at? Mm. Six. Six. Okay, God promised a curse upon his unfaithful but chosen people of destiny as they wanted the world without their promised land. God warned that wherever, wherever they wanted, the Jews would be what? Astonishment. Astonish. A proverb, a byword, a curse, curse and a reproach. reproach. And, and to put it in in, 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 in hoods, hood language, a joke. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And that's no. absolutely what they were. And what they were. And what they want. And what again? I mean, they they everybody looked down on them. Everybody hated them when they come to America here. <laughs> you know, we know what happened to them in Germany. We know all this. You know what I'm saying? The Bible yeah. is true. They like a bad boy. Yeah. And here's, here's the thing about it. They come to this land hated America. Mm -hmm. Hated. But somehow, God prospered them. Sure did. Even in the midst of Egypt, being hated, made slaves, mm -hmm. God prospered them. Yeah. Can you see the same thing? Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Until right now, Jews own New York City. Well, 75 went mm -hmm. into Egypt. 
Went in there. Yeah, when they first went in. Millions came out. Millions. In, in the midst of persecution. In the midst of it. What would that say? You 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 can't beat these people down. You can't you can't eradicate these people. Can we say that? Well, you're not fighting these people. Oh, oh, how, how, oh, how quick will you realize that it's not oh. these people you're fighting? Right, right, right. So that's what people don't realize today. Uh, right there now, you're not fighting these. You're not fighting these people. You're fighting God. Yeah. These people are fighting God and fighting God's word. And that is a what kind of a battle they call it? Something futile. Like L. A a losing battle. Lose. <laughs> a losing lose. battle. <laughs> okay, then uh, what we got there? We got the uh, no, seven million. God promised to chase it. Uh oh, he's unfaithful. It is. But chosen people are destined. Father Moses prophet declared that these scattered people were not only be slandered, denigrated, discriminated against, but they would be persecuted and killed mm. as no other people on the faith of the earth would be killed. History stands as eloquent witness to the fact that this is precisely what has happened to the Jews. Century after century, wherever. They were found. They hunted them like they were dogs. Yeah. Look at the Holocaust. Yeah. What the Germans went to. Absolutely. Yes, sir. All over the world. Everywhere they've been. Yeah, everywhere they've been. Everywhere they've been. But yet and still, they still exist. And they stay and they prosper. Doing all. And they prosper on top of that. But you got to remember what they hold. Hmm? Let the blood be on our hands. That's what they said. And our children. That's what okay. they said. That was See, that all, was, all of that. that was, all of that. But 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 what we're saying here is with that. You can't get past the sovereignty of God. He behind and the, all of and the promise of God. The promise of God. He's standing, yeah. still standing on that. I don't care what they done went through, what they've done. The promise of God is still standing today. So God will say to you and me, I can beat them, but you can't beat them. <laughs> Unless I let tell you. Okay, okay. Well, I said that by no time. Okay, same thing. I put a knot on the head, but don't you touch it. <laughs> Don't you put no hands. Yeah, don't you touch. So they buy me. They're but they buy me. Yeah. 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 Okay, uh, he would not let the chosen people be destroyed, but would preserve them as an, an identifiable ethnic national group. They kept identity already. Yeah. Somehow Still. they kept that. Still. In the scattering. That's right. The Still. Jews had every reason to intermarry, to change their name, but a lot of them did change their name. You know mm -hmm. that. Uh, and uh, hide their identity by any possible means in order to escape, escape persecution. persecution. Hmm? You'll be surprised how many changed their names. I don't know the man. Well, that's why I say the name. That, that's why I say the name. I don't know. Only, only God know who they are. <laughs> only God know who, only God know that's who, who, who his right. people are. Only God. And he do know. Yeah, absolutely. Every one of them. Yeah. Huh? Every one of them. I, you know that I'm not Tony. If you cut my finger off and get my fingerprint, you know I'm not Tony and Tony not me, right? right. You mean right. God got a way of identifying yeah. these people all over the world? Yeah, I'm saying. God got, how you do it though, y'all? How you do it, y'all? He's, He's, He's God. He's God. He's God. He's God. So, so Paul was right when he said all Jews are not really Jews. That's right. That's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. And look at that promise, number nine. Number nine. God promised to regather His chosen people of destiny back to the promised land. Mm. The Bible declared that God determined to keep his chosen people separated to himself because he would bring them back into their land in the last days prior to the Messiah second coming. That prophecy and promise, so long awaited, was fulfilled in the rebirth of Israel in her promised land. It happened at, at last in 1948, nearly 1900 years after the final diaspora of the world. At the destruction of Jerusalem, that when Jerusalem fell down to the ground, eighty-seven Roman by the Roman army, army in the general Titus. This restoration of a nation after twenty-five centuries woo, is utterly astonishing, a phenomenal without parallel mm -hmm. in the history of any other people, and inexplicable by any natural means, much less by chance. There you go. Yeah. That's it. Didn't happen, Didn't happen by chance. Brothers, not brothers. Didn't happen by chance. Sum it up, Kevin. Sum it up now. What, 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 what are we trying to communicate? What are we trying to communicate here? Do the people alone. <laughs> <laughs> but I think we need to realize. <laughs> Yes. Now, we really do need to realize first, like you said, the number one thing is that we need to understand that God chose those people. Okay. okay. And he chose those people not because of, of their goodness. No. Their works. Okay. It's because he made a promise to the father of those people and ours, the father of our faith, Abraham. Abraham. He made a promise. 
and he doesn't go back on his word. Okay, never he, do. He's so in love with Jerusalem, mm -hmm. with Israel, mm -hmm. is that in the end, most of them will be destroyed by God. Mm. Most of them will be destroyed, but the true Jews will survive, and then he gonna make a new Jerusalem, a, a new Jerusalem, a new Jerusalem, all because of his word. Yeah, yeah. Because we just said that you know all Jews that say they're Jews are not. Yeah, we don't, know. Yeah, we don't know because of the mixed multitude. We don't know, but that's no. his wrath. But he knows, though. Yes. Yeah, he knows. he knows that she. Yeah. He knows. The Book of Romans he talks knows. about that. He knows that she. The true Jews will live. They will survive. Glory. I'll go ahead, Tony. Not he'll, he'll give him something there, but well, oh man, that's good. That's yeah, good. We, we, we've we've good. said a lot here. We've said a lot. We, we said a whole and lot. now one one of the one of the lads, that was ten of Pastor Red nine, but one of the lads, number ten, said God promised to make his chosen people a destiny, a source of fear. For the whole world. Yeah, I didn't mm. get that one. When they get back to the promised land. Read this okay. Okay. Now, God declared that yeah. in the last days before the Messiah's second coming, Jerusalem will become a cup of trembling, a mm. burdensome stone for all people. Okay. Uh, at the time Zechariah uttered this prophecy 2,500 years ago, Jerusalem lay in ruins. At that point. At yeah. That point. yeah. It was surrounded by a wilderness. Mm. And so mm. it remained centuries after century after century. Zechariah prophecy seemed to be utter madness, even after Israel rebirth in 1948. Mm. But yet today, mm. exactly mm. as foretold, mm. a world of nearly 6 billion people yeah. has their lives upon Jerusalem. Mm. Fearful that the next world war, if it breaks out, will be fought over that tiny city. Mm. What an incredible fulfillment of promise. A world war. Just think about it, y'all. Yeah. Just think about it. Yeah. Yeah. That tiny city, when all the, when that prophecy was made by Zechariah over 2,500 years ago, that was a wilderness. Yeah. Sure. It was nothing there. Yeah. It was nothing yeah. there. Yeah. 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 So anybody reading that prophecy then said, man, Zechariah been smoking some of that. He got a hold of some bad stuff. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but, but look well, how he got it now. Look what he's over there now, right now. Exactly yeah. like he promised. Prophesied, it unfolded exactly the same way. Do, does that give you confidence in God? Absolutely. Our God is sovereign uh, uh, and He's worthy to be praised, y'all. Hey. If you haven't given Him your life yet, let the day be your well, day. Get on God's team, don't you? Go ahead, Bill. Give us the code. You know, that, that, that is amazing, though. But, yeah. but see, yeah. we as believers, we as true believers, mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. done read the Revelation. And yes, and God. read and continue to read. Continue to read. <laughs> yes, Lord. And we continue to see these Lord. promises being fulfilled. Yes, yes. You know, it makes me think about you know when he told them that they would go in bondage for seventy years. Yeah, four hundred yeah. men. Yeah, uh, and then four, after they, four, 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 he said that precise day. I, I, yeah, the precise they, day they coming out. They came exactly. out. They coming out. Yeah. Ain't that I mean? Yeah. I mean, it's fulfilled. That's yeah. right. And that, you know, I'm, I'm always thinking about the scripture, my favorite scripture, Second Peter three and nine, where it says, mm -hmm. "The Lord is not slack concerning his promises, concerning his promises, mm -hmm. but what? As As some men count, count yeah. Yeah. but it's long suffering. Long suffering. You see that long suffering mm -hmm. because." There's other sheep. Out that's right. Because that's, that's, that's right. Because that's right. Of us that got to right. come in. Yeah. yeah, and that's our job. That's why we're here now. That's right. it. We're trying to round them up. We're, we're trying, trying to, to with the help of the, you yeah. know, with, with the, through the power of God. Yeah, right. yeah. To, to enlighten people. To enlighten people. Man. So we can prepare and get ready. Get ready. Huh? That's right. All that's right. I can say, I, I, my closing remark gonna be just like what Jeff Campbell said. <laughs> Uh, leave them people wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Father, bless you, Lord. We thank you for yes, this time, Lord. Lord. We just pray, Father God, your word, your word, your word will touch the hearts of your people. Help us realize, Lord, that we're on the Lord's side. Yes. Amen. And on those whom the Lord has chosen, Father. Yes, right. Let this be solidified in the heart and minds of the, your people today yes. and people all around. In Jesus' in name Jesus we pray. Name. Amen. 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 All right. That's good, my brother. That's a good, good. take.